makeup tutorial and today I'm doing a kind of bronzy golden um, like brownish makeup if you are interested in the tutorial just keep on watching I'm just gonna clip my hair out of the way so it won't bother me I already have on my uh, Bourjois Healthy Mix foundation and Healthy Mix concealer. Now I'm gonna do my eyebrows, just define them, brush them through using my Art Deco eyebrow pencil in number six, which I always use. I've been doing the same things for my brows for years, I mean, using the same pencil, defining them the same way, it's just the way I like my brows to be. You always have to brush your brows through when you pencil them in because otherwise it can look a little bit harsh. So that's it for my brows. Um, as an eyeshadow base, I'm using the usual Wet n Wild eyeshadow in Brulee. I'll need to get a new one soon because I use this every single day. Just all over the lid up to the brow bone. Okay, next thing I'm gonna use all over the lid again is the eyeshadow from the L'Oreal Color Appeal Tria Palette for grey eyes the Letizia Casta Palette and I'm gonna use the number 2 this middle shade, it's like a golden uh, brown color I think it's similar to Max Patina which I love so I'm just gonna apply the shade all over the lid. It's a shimmering eyeshadow, so it will give a nice uh, golden brownish color to the eyelid. I like to drag my eyeshadow, you know, outwards to have that feline look same on the other one and the colors I think, think they look very very similar to the Dior's new uh, summer palettes the rose tan and the nude rose because they have you know this very similar shades like pinkish brownish and like a deeper plummy pink kind of color I really wanted to get the those Dior palettes. They're the colors I love, but I remember that I have this one that's very similar, so I didn't get the Dior one. So like that, you can blend it with a fluffy brush. I'm using my Eco Tools brush, which I love. I use it for everything basically. So if you can see that, I have some beautiful shimmer through my eyelids next thing, thing I'm gonna apply is the Essence eyeshadow in number 17 Teddy and it's such a beautiful very warm brown chocolate brown shade with some gold particles so I'm gonna take a small eyeshadow brush like this and I'm gonna concentrate on the outer V of my eyes just gonna apply through the corners of my eyelid creating that V shape going inwards just a little bit 
but not going all the way to my inner corner, just on the outer leaf. I'm gonna apply the same eyeshadow on my bottom lash line. Pull it outwards. Take a blending brush and blend it again. So we have that brown kind of smoky eye and blend a lot I mean I like to blend my eyeshadow so that it looks really small you know smoky and very soft so the next thing I'm using is the Chanel Style You waterproof eyeliner in brown espresso I'm just gonna apply it on my um, upper lash line I'm dragging it outwards just a little bit, not doing the cat eye, just a tiny bit. Again for that more feline look. Not not too much. On the lower lash line I applied just on the outer third of my eye just on the corner okay my eyeliner is done yeah so I have this soft brown smoky eye look that's bronzy now I'm just gonna apply my uh, Rimmel Sexy Curves Mascara, which I really really like. Okay, my eyes are done. Now I'm gonna continue with the rest of my face. Um, with my Body Shop's big uh, face and body brush, I'm gonna apply my Chanel Universal Powder all over my face just to set my makeup concentrating on the t-zone because that's where um, I get the most shine have a very oily t-zone okay Using same brush, I'm gonna apply my NARS Laguna bronzer. And I'm gonna apply this as a contour and as a blush because today I'm not gonna use any blush. because we are creating that bronzy look so I don't want any pinks or col corals on my forehead for more sculpted effect on the temples on my nose, chin just all over the face basically And now I'm gonna use my Dior Amber Diamond Highlighter, to, which is amazing, I love it, to highlight my cheekbones. Using a fan brush, I'm gonna apply it on the tops of my cheeks, in a, like this, swirling motion, the center of my nose, Cupid's bow. And using the 
eyeshadow brush. I'm gonna take the lightest shade here. It's a very pale champagne color. And I'm gonna apply it on the inner in my tear duct. So it gives a gorgeous shine, like a opens up the eyes and looks really pretty. And on my lips I'm wearing Maybelline Color Sensational Lip Gloss, Lip Gloss Lipstick in number 842 Rosewood Pearl. It's such an accurate name for this lipstick because it's like a brownish rosy color. And I'm gonna apply for a little bit of uh, glossiness the Essence XXL Shine Lip Gloss in Big Night Out, which is a really good match for the lipstick. They look great paired together because the colors are very similar. And I love these lip glosses by Essence, they are not sticky, very well pigmented and smell delicious so that's my finished what I would call bronze goddess look um, just a brown smoky eye lots of bronzer and brownish lip I'm sorry if the light is washing me out, but I hope you can see the look. So, hope you guys enjoyed, and if you have any other requests, so leave them in the comment section down below. And thanks for watching, see you soon.